Ahoy everyone and welcome aboard, I'll be your Captain Hillian tonight along with... Fearsome First Midrack Kiel at your service, live from Hillian's Closet. <laughs> and welcome back to Indiana Jones and the Infernal Machine. And yeah, I, I just realized I forgot to <laughs> forgot to move over your little signpost. But Again. oh well. 
Uh, let's see. Last time we got into this volcano here under... Uh, I, for I always forget which, sea uh, uh, which ocean is which. But we're in the... Uh, yeah. In the eastern half of the world. Underneath a tropical island. Where... Uh, yeah, we're in a blasted volcano. Uh, and if we so much as toss the lava, we go out of the blast. I've I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go here. Yep. For Speaking now, of. Now you got Bloody heck. That's some uh, aggressive hot sauce. Yeah. Uh, like, okay. I, I think it's pa Pacific Ocean? I said it hesitantly. I think it is, yeah, because during World War II it was the Pacific uh, Theater, I believe. And hello there, Noon, with the finally adjusted chat box. <laughs> so. Yeah. Hello, Noon. That should, uh, that should be a lot less across the game and more just off to the side. It might make things a little bit annoying to read, but oh well. It was probably uh, a bit more, more annoying to read before when it had uh, was partly in-game and off-game. Yeah, and if there was a white background at the moment, yeah, good luck. Anyways, yeah. the reason that I'm pulling out this thing, which I still forget the freaking name of, of what it looks like. Uh, maracas. Yeah, Maracas. Yeah, here we go. Deal with this sneaky bastard. Oh, and get ourselves hurt by the reek, <laughs> by the blast. Okay. Uh, hey. Let's see. Yep. Already too late on that. <laughs> We've already jumped in at least once now. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, he has. I've been avoiding it. And now I'm on one of those. And yeah. Uh, For a split second, I thought you were to accidentally walk into it. No, not this time. Okay. Now there is the background. Now, let's see. What do we have around here? A door. A green door. What is... Oh. This is the handle. I'm guessing. The door has stubby little protrusions. Stubby. Hmm. Let's see. I I think there was something that we did last time that did something with the door, but I get what. Okay, I was I was expecting the jump to go a bit longer than that. Okay. That, that little music bit is supposed to sound tragic and all, but with how often we are hearing it, it's becoming more hilarious. Yeah, accidentally, and bloody heck, this tastes good. He says, as Noon posted in the chat, I think Rakia would be fine with the lava bath, though, so don't eat the lava. Uh, no, no, I'm just... I made... literal pizza sandwiches in the, that came... In the shape of pizza slices. And I added some hot sauce on them. Let's see, we've explored. So I've eaten something spicy, but not this spicy. Uh, sorry, I interrupted you again. Uh, not really. Uh, we've explored over to the left. We have explored over behind us. So, yeah, we have one area left. Go. Okay, mm. seems proximity is related to damage. Some medicine. Also, just so we don't have to do that jumping bit again. And... Mm. <laughs> <sighs> <laughs> well, that's a clip. <laughs> Uh, like the the jump is a li is a bit. The moment that I jump, it sinks back in. The jump is a little bit shorter than, yeah, you really expect. <laughs> is this one of these days my cheeks won't gonna hurt yeah, because of your? Spain a row. Yeah, I'm not going to make another clip. <laughs> uh. 
Uh, yeah, uh, I made a small change in the stream deck in that now when I press the click button, it also saves the replay in the OBS's replay buffer. So I can, yeah, up, I can upload those to uh, YouTube as well without having to download the shorts from uh, Twitch. Plus I can edit them a bit to, uh, yeah, make them a bit less bloated around than around what is actually happening. Okay. Is there another sneaky here? No, there's not. And I see Nunez has some panic. <laughs> I was expecting to have <laughs> some <laughs> leverage. Uh. Fail. Fail, Fail again. <laughs> this is going to be the episode where Dr. Jones explodes. Uh. Actually, can we just... No, not like that, but can we... Do a... Uh, doctor, <laughs> please go back into the normal state of reality. Uh, <laughs> Killian! Okay, he's... <laughs> just... You're breaking the game now! Apparently. Okay. Can we just also, jump up? Oop. I just Oop. realized something. Barely. Oh. Um. How would gunpowder react to be, uh, being near lava? It would probably go up from the heat alone. So. Or just ex explode. Yeah. <laughs> Realistically speaking, uh, we would have. A hole blown in our back and hip by now. Yeah, do, in a way, would that basically mean him exploding and touching lava sort of makes sense? True, yeah. <laughs> Actually, that, that makes out. That makes more sense than the, yeah, the other, but that still doesn't explain why the walkway in the previous stream just went up like a bomb when it fell in. Yeah. I think mean, this is a case where it, they, by accident, made it semi-realistic. Probably, is, I think it should already explode by now. Yeah. Also, isn't this where we entered the place? There, have we oh, just sure. gone for the ground? Or... Yeah. Okay, I was expecting... <laughs> I was expecting a platform to appear before us. <laughs> and apparently, uh, uh, the heat is causing Noon's pizza to melt. Wait, we're both eating pizza? Apparently. Mm. Well, wait, are you also eating pizza sandwich or actual pizza? There we go, skip that bitch. Mm, let's see, do we have something here? We have the red tiki key. You always eat the pizza. Hold on. No? Are you green? It fits. There we go. I had a feeling once I noticed the in the little dent in the side of it. What the fuck is coming at us? Uh, oh, monkeys. Like they're not normal monkeys. And no, are you sure you're not a turtle? Okay, the monkey doesn't want the fight. <laughs> That's a bit of a rarity at times. I, <laughs> I think I think it actually killed one of the spiders. Uh, let's see. I'm always eating a pizza piece to miss the natural diet of a fox. Though I'm more beige colored. <laughs> okay. I still suspect he to be a ninja turtle. Hmm. I don't think the I don't think the TMNT ever had a fox-like character. So what is with the I had to check for. I had some of the old comics. The more almost child-friendly ones, and there were some characters that were cool, but also. Uh, almost gave me nightmares. 
<laughs> Pardon? Hmm. <laughs> yeah. Comics like that can typically get a lot get away with a lot more than the original series. Let's see. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> uh, at least this go on, sorry. Yeah, just reading chat. Uh, I have a fluffy long tail and ooh, point tails. Yep. God damn it. Wait, no poisoning? Okay. Ooh, one shot, one kill for once. Uh, let's see, I have a fluffy long tail and pointy ears and snout. I'm pretty sure I'm a fox. <laughs> okay, then what does the fox say, Noon? Yeah, I actually knew joke. what a fox says. <laughs> I've actually been uh, with work. I've actually seen foxes on the semi regular. Oh dear! It's, Did they it's try some... anything? Uh, no, typically they're just scampering around. I haven't seen them attack anything or anyone like that. Let's see. That part is out. Oh, are most more of the, them trying to break in? Mm, no. What the noon linked me something in memes and hello rum. Wait, hey, hello. Oh. <laughs> <Good story. laughs> okay, I I severely missed size that new picture for you. So give me a second here. Wait, hold on, this is kind of hilarious. Rom <laughs> is my parrot. Why am I on, why on <laughs> the parrot's uh, parrot. shoulder? Uh, um. I think I'm supposed to be one on people's shoulder, not the other way around. Okay. Uh, give me a second here. I thought it would resize to the same <laughs> bit, but apparently not. Uh, let's see. Uh, 716, and then here. Build, uh, build difficulties, everyone. <laughs> let's see. Uh, let me take a picture of this before. So I know what to reset things to if I mess things up even further. Okay, there, and then let's just have that match, or not like that. Uh, one six, oh. <laughs> that doesn't work. Uh, let's see, three fifty, no. Yeah, fuck it, mash the size of that. Then here we go. Six, seven, five. I don't know why it's just putting it only the corner or something like you know, why I don't know why it's doing that. Uh, I'll have to take a look into that. Uh, but <laughs> it looks better, at least for the moment. I'll have to fully resize that another time. Yeah, but now it looks like he's trying to kiss my hand. <laughs> or smell if I have any food on the, the hand. Uh, Do you have food? I had a. I, I just finished eating my sandwich pizza. So sorry, I have no food to share. There we go. Uh, fine. <laughs> That's Rom's new picture, and I do not get why OBS is just completely undersized it, but oh well. Back to the game then. Uh, you doing well, Ron? Uh... I'm doing all right. Kind of bored and sleepy at times. Also, the weather here makes no sense. And the like... game is stuck. <laughs> God damn it. Th uh, oh. uh, somebody cue the Ashens technical difficulties music. Yeah, I, I forgot. We had... This game does not like when we feed with other things off screen. Let me put this we did away something again. like this before. And just start it from here. Luckily, we put a safe a lot closer now. Uh, yeah. Not that button. Me. Just restarting the game fixes the issue. Here we go. And it restarts easily enough. Okay. Uh, 7.6. There we go. Okay, back to the <laughs> back to the volcano. Let's see then. Okay, I missed that in the distance there. That is definitely something that we need to go to, though. Uh, let's. Okay, that's 
There might be something hidden behind that rock, so let's go take a look there first. I see a Komodo dragon over there. Oop. Yeah, okay, this right. time. I just made it. We may not be in the Pacific Ocean, but we near it, but... Oh, bloody hell, what is it called? Oceanian Ocean? Yeah, East Indian Ocean or something, do you mean that? Yeah, maybe? Hmm. Oh, bloody heck. Yeah, Pacific yeah. Atlantic Ocean are the two easiest ones to remember. Okay, let's deal with these, and what the heck is over here, then? Now, pull out your knife and start skinning them for, uh, for their <laughs> This isn't pelts. Red Dead. <laughs> oh, wait. I wouldn't be against streaming Red Dead at one point, though, though it would probably take forever. Likely, and I just remembered. I mean, it's the original force or another game you can actually make armor out of Komodo Dragon skin. Okay. Or lizard skin, so to speak. Oh, waterfall. Let's have a look here. There's a climbable point with the whip to our right here. But how do we get to that? Hmm. Hold on. Hold on. I think the monkey monkeys are trying to help you. Let's actually check the map. Okay, we can't get to that from here, but we are supposed to go this way, apparently. Mm. So, yeah. Down we go. Oh, dear. And uh, by the way, <laughs> Zoom ahead. Bloody heck. I thought you were dead for a moment there first. Uh, right, don't ask. Uh, Rob, you said your weather did not make sense? Okay, no, can't go that way. on Friday it decided to rain. And then uh, every once in a while, the rain just comes up late and makes things sillier. There's apparently a cyclone that gonna pass by Lima. Yay. From rain to cyclone. Yes. I will look at a weird I used to call it bad luck. Yeah. Let's see. So the correction, very bad luck. The yeah, cyclones have a habit of pushing other weather around ahead of them, so yeah, that's <laughs> That's not going to make things any easier. Oh, it is not. What the? Why does these stone ladders look like teeth? Yeah, they've probably just been because carved they... into the stone. Also, they only had the one, uh, the one texture. Yeah, they look kind of terrifying. You're gonna half expect them to be mimics. <laughs> The mountain is a mimic, Harry. Uh, it reminds me of something that I'm not fully remembering at the moment, but it was one of those "you're uh, something" uh, <laughs> Harry memes. Yeah, I think it was you're, "you're in the way, Harry," and just had to have edited picture of Hagrid tossing Harry aside. Oh God! Like I, I'm not a Harry Potter fan. I'm not. I don't hate them. I don't love them either. But I. I do like some of the memes, especially the ones you can feed around with. <laughs> the memes, yes. but how to solve Harry Potter? Easy, give the kids the guns. Those were, uh, I don't know. Like, you yeah. know, they're gonna work with spells and shit at Hogwarts? Nah, give them the bag. <laughs> give, like. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, I noticed the holes a second before that. Like half a second. Oh. Okay. Don't look at uh. a giant syringe. <laughs> that That's the joke is like, oh, they gotta deal with like 
fucking spells and shit where he's a well here's a nine millimeter Voldemort. <laughs> Bang. There he's dead. I cast oh, Harry this bitch. <laughs> Okay, I don't like that rumbling noise. Heck, come on, I know you won't like that. There we go. Okay. I don't know if this is on the main path or the side path, but I'm pretty sure we need to go find a key somewhere. Because that door back there, uh, the other way, had a, yeah, a hey. lock on it. So we need to find a key somewhere. Okay, no ambush spiders. Hmm. Yeah, I don't trust any cave that has webbing uh, hanging from the ceiling. Um, I mean, that's a good habit. Yeah, like, I don't... Basically, I don't trust any place that has webbing around the place anyways. Because I, I've, I've probably told this a few times before, but uh, Dr. Jones may have a thing which against snakes. I have it against spiders. Because as a kid, I used to run around uh, outside a lot, and then I'd have the bad fucking luck of just running through fucking webs. Yeah, that that's kind of annoying. Me, do I? I was. I think I was lucky to avoid the bigger ones. Yeah, I don't remember if I ever ran through any inhabited ones, but uh, yeah, when you already bother sensitive to touch, yeah, that's a hard nope. Uh. Now what? Wait. Don't Peru have big spiders? <laughs> that is some sort of advice. Also applies to the World Wide Web. <laughs> oh, good God. Yeah, I, I, I heard that you, you fucker for my Christmas calendar. The youth uh, that has a giant spider on the internet. I think you missed every shot against the spider. There it is. Now it's dead. Hit. Now get your lighter out. Oh, wait, no, this is in Metro. Uh, uh, by the way, Rob, mm -hmm. uh, how big does the spiders get in Peru? I sense a trap. Too big. Nah, this is in Australia. We have regular sized spiders. <laughs> Uh, now, if you want something large that can kill you, Australia is the place for you. Yeah, with basically any everything, even the fucking kangaroos can kill you. Yeah. <laughs> there's, there's, those things kick like a motherfucker, which makes sense. Yeah. They, 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 they walk on them all the time, or jump with them all the time. Yeah, the only ones that kick us have more deadly kicks than kangaroo or emus and cassowary. Okay. Um, so, I mean, Australia went to war against the birds, and they lost. Uh, okay, I was I oh, was well, thinking well, well. we can go through by walking slowly, since that works in Tomb Raider. Nope. <laughs> Did you see um, the warning uh, thing? Like, did you not see Harold here? Yeah, I saw him, but I thought uh, that the same trick in Tomb Raider would work here. So yeah, we'll just have to. Carefully walk our way through these to avoid end up, yeah, ending up as a Siska Bob or a Siska Jones. Oh, come on! Let's see. Why does. Oh, it's water. I thought it was different colored grounds. Let's see then. Is this just the way back or something? Hmm. Maybe. Nope. Nope. There we go. And now we are here with the swinging pole. Uh, but yeah. To finish a bit. It's not that I. It's not that I'm actually afraid of spiders or anything. I just find them utterly and completely disgusting. Boy, do I have the game for you. Have you ever heard of EDF? Yeah, oh. I, I thought you were going to say kill it with fire. Same here. 
same here. I put that at the swell. Yeah, it's a treasure. I mean, there. you can't do that in in uh, EDF. Oh, I forgot EDF have some very um, cow-sized spiders. And that, and ants, and at one point dragons. Yeah, that, that can be so. I, I don't think Amber enjoyed playing the game for you so too random, but yep. I sure as heck enjoy the song. Just doing a quickly ro reload because I want that treasure and I was pressing the wrong button. Yep. Still miss. Uh, okay. Careful. Can I get to that just from down here somewhere? Let's see. Down. I can't stay for too long. I'm actually kind of sleepy. No problem. No worries. Uh, I think I'm gonna leave. You guys have fun and good luck. So, yeah. oh, thank you. Yep. And be safe, Rom. It loops yeah, around. Be safe too. See so, ya. Yeah. Ubi plan too. <laughs> okay. Oh, it's nice to see him visit. Yeah, we really should uh, see when next we can stream binary domain sometime. This door is locked. Yeah. Okay, we yeah. missed where we need to go. Or where we need to yeah, that, that one. That one accidentally. Uh, but it's not been dropped, but it got very accidentally heavily delayed. Yeah. Uh, since we're also doing Borderlands, where he is a part as well. So, yeah, <laughs> a bit taxing on his end uh, with how early things are over there in Peru. Yeah, uh, do you use yawn? <clears throat> Halfway. <laughs> uh, don't, don't tell me you just woke up one hour ago. Wait, when did you wake up? Uh, around five, actually, and it's eight now. Oh, all right. Not too bad. I see a little shit on the wall there. Who shit's on the wall? Yeah, there's a spider in the web there. Is there actually anything down here? Yeah, there he goes. Or comes. Let's see, nothing here? Okay. Hmm. Wait, what did we miss then? Uh, but yeah, we really should see when next we can uh, stream Binary Domain again. It shouldn't take too many more streams to get that finished, like one or two, I think. Yeah. Also, I noticed about something about the traps there. Hmm? They look like angry frogs with lion manes. I think they're supposed to be mouths, or, yeah, open open mouths. Yeah, for, guess what, Helian? Fro frogs are very much a lot of mouth. Yeah. Okay, last second, and still miss. Yeah. Hmm. If you look uh, look at them, you think you, you see why, why I... Okay, didn't I need thought to they were further away. I didn't need to, to take that close of a look. There we go. Oh. Okay, he was scuttling sideways for a second there. Look what I found. All right. Yeah, let's go take a look. I had to say, spiders have been that big in the past, but they are extinct. Yeah, luckily. And they can't grow that big anymore because there's not enough oxygen in the air to support that size. Yeah, there's a whole... I forget what the specific word for it is, but a rule or principle or something in biology that after a certain size, it becomes... Yeah, life becomes unfeasible because it just burns too much uh, 
It, it needs too much energy to continue living, and it just becomes too heavy for its own bones. In this case, they don't have iron blood as us. Yeah, that as well. That, 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 hence why they could grow up so big in the past. But they had so much more air that they, they're... I forgot if it's copper spiders and other bugs have. But due to the quality not being too good for drying air, they needed so much to grow big. And now they can't grow that big because we don't have enough air to help them. We can because our blood is better at absorbing air, oxygen, and all that. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. I think you meant more like uh, not less, not more air in the well, air, but more oxygen. Oxygen, I mean, uh, iron-based blood yes. is better at absorbing, yeah. <clears throat> yeah, and I think spiders and bugs have. I think we we, we have red, which are uh, iron, and I think spiders and that are green, which means copper. Do we need to use I... the same key or something? Oh, hello. I, I know I learned that the. If something has blue blood, it means the blood is heavy in cobalt. Okay. I have no idea if cobalt is good for... What what benefit cobalt does. I wouldn't be surprised if a bunch of royals back a century or two probably sniffed at the sea. Or ate it just believing that it would be good. <laughs> you would not believe the sort of shit rich people got up to, uh, sometimes rather literally, if they thought that it would uh, help them somewhat. Yeah, like a certain, I forgot if it was a queen or baroness, who bathed in what was a mix of her servant's blood and milk. Uh, let's see. I think that might have been. Let's see. Oh wait, that that, that, that didn't that... quite work. I think it's both a queen and baroness that did that. Hmm. I think that's the origin of Bloody Mary or something. Let's see. There's a cave might down be. there. I have to look at that. But yeah, there, there has been very crazy people. Like there was a. I forgot which king this was. But there was a king that was so convinced that he was a wolf made of glass. <laughs> okay, that's a new one. Okay. Uh, not what I meant to do there. <laughs> He's just standing on the water. Yeah, what the hell? What was, wait, did we survive? You survived? I mean... Uh, okay, no, wait, I no, no, this. Now, now even I say we, when it's more you. Since you I call commentating. You hold the controller. Yeah. Okay, the access pointing towards the broken bridge here. Is there something underneath there that we haven't seen yet? Sure. And also, they made these community dragons rather small, young. I mean, but they grew bigger than this. Yeah, the older ones would probably know to stay away from humans. Uh, actually, no. If they saw you wounded, the big ones will pounce on you instantly. Yeah, but For otherwise... they know they can overpower you easily. <laughs> Noon, imagine your king is a furry. Oh, good gods. Okay, we are very obviously missing something somewhere. Is this something underwater or so? I'm getting a bit tired of just running around in loops. Yeah, so we're going to need to investigate uh, where we need to go do. Hmm. Yeah, there's nothing down here. How the hell do we get into that cave over there? Is there also, any place sorry, the map that has a gap? Hmm. 
Mm -hmm. see? I think I remember something here now. It says something new just reminded me of something here. Mm -hmm. I think a. Okay, I might be wrong on nation here. I might be wrong here, but I think a German noble was born with. Oh, blood that way is that the condition called? What is a condition syndrome or what? But when you are born, I just grew a lot of hair all over you. Okay. I, I forgot what it's called, but... Uh, you know, back then, they thought he was a different species. Sounds like something that would probably get named, uh, or the simple name would be, uh, like, werewolf syndrome or something. I think that is the nickname for it, not the official name, but a nickname. Yeah. For people still being born with this today, but today, Aha. it don't treat them as a different species, we treat them as a, as a people. Yeah. Okay. Dude, Arian, yeah. if you need another species, we should probably treat them as people as well. Yeah. Uh, but we already have enough trouble uh, with some people treating other humans as if they are completely different species. Uh, There's a horrible world we live in. What am I missing? Let's go through one more loop and yeah, then call it. Or then not call it, but uh, look it up. Yeah. Oh, love of all, Helian! <laughs> what? From what look at you to jump into Harold's Pike! <laughs> Let's see. And before people ask, I don't know what is with me and the name Harold. I don't know what. Why I usually go to with the name Harold when I name a random NPC or something. Uh, the maybe Ulrich that was is... you were uh, going to be named at first or something. Wait, what? Maybe that was what you were going to be named at first or something by your parents. Luckily it was not that. I, I, I think it started a lot. Thanks to I started to watch Monty Python episodes on YouTube when the main of the episodes were still there. there and go. Harold often came up there. Especially from the when they act as a granny. Hmm. And the name kinda stuck. I think all of the Monty Python folk are in the grave by now. Uh, no, no. I'm entirely sure. Maybe. One, one I know is. But I don't know about the rest. I, they Many of them are still alive though. Okay, because I knew that at least one of them, the quote-unquote head of the group, I believe he was considered. Uh, except the Black Knight. What about the Black Knight? But, but do we even know if he's dead? Uh, it's the Black Knight. You, <laughs> He didn't die after getting all of his limbs chopped off, so who's to say that he would after... Uh, <laughs> he would die normally anyways. Hmm. He probably return uh, the same way as a uh, what the chaos dwarfs in Warhammer did when his uh, arms and legs turned to stone. Compact, stronger, better with a mech suit. He was uh, here. I thought you were going to say he went to the gym and returned with rock hard abs. They probably have that for apparently when dwarves practice matching like a wizard, their body will slowly turn to stone. Okay. And then they were there, and the bit, and here's another thing about the chaos dwarves is whenever their sorcerer prophets and such becomes fully stone, they take them to the most holy temple. I put them on display along the pathway to the temple. And they're still alive. Yeah, getting stoned for your gods. Yeah, and I got his hashut. 
So ba basically, chaos dwarves are violent hippies. I wanna not say hippies. That's probably the worst incorrect way you could describe them. There, it is the funny one. Do we have to jump that or something? Hmm. Okay, now that we've got the treasures as well. Uh, what the heck can... is... <laughs> Wait, what have you written that? Damn those stone dwarves in their hot... Damn Something those stone mine? dwarves in our hot box mines. <laughs> hot box mine. Well, the areas is known as the Darklands, and I may know the places are called uh, Plain of Fire and all that, so, um... So... The Danklands? Are you being, trying to be sarcastic? <laughs> no, I'm trying to be funny. <laughs> nope, that also oh, doesn't long. work. So how do we get in this place? Your joke. <laughs> I think it was too much for him. Amazing. Mm. Oh okay. dear. But yeah, the main lead of the Chaos Dwarf, the strongest of the Sophrus Prophet, especially the leader of them all currently, is basically someone with a, whose arms and legs has turned to stone so that he put himself into a steampunk mech suit. There's one area up... Oh. Now, now it's all red. I was going to say there is that one area up to the right at the moment between, yeah, the, not that. That has gaps, but I think that's environmental stuff. The, I think that's the. Uh, let's see. I think that is. Yeah, I think that's where the swing part is. You, you, you just got killed by accident. Yeah, what? <laughs> you, did you notice what you just did? Uh, no, because I was focusing on the map. You, um, hummed Indiana Jones' melody. Okay, if I did, I didn't do it intentionally. <laughs> yeah, that's what I reacted. Like, uh. you just... Da, 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 just like that. <laughs> <laughs> be making my thinking noises. Yeah, you for once actually did the Indiana Jones version of it. Probably by the accident. Yeah. <laughs> oh, but you should have clipped that. Hmm. Okay, let me start looking up stuff. Uh, Indiana Jones and the Machine. Yeah, uh, why do you do that? I got uh, that move walk. Apparently, I'm extremely thirsty. Hmm. Uh, do, do you want a water bowl as well, uh, Noon? I think he has enough dignity to want a bottle, not a bowl. <laughs> Let's see, turn this off for a second. Oop. I, I do not get why he just spins so fast. When walking, there we go, and yeah, that's the waterfall as I suspected. And back. Temple, temple. Well, well, he. he here you go, new. Here's your bowl of water. Well, you said he had uh, too much dignity to drink from a bowl. Drink volcano. More volcano. Temple. Okay. Uh, let's see then. Okay. Next page is needed for this. Uh, I, I just like wait. 
Uh, what is that? That can't be the end of that level. Wait, hold up. What's that? That's something flashy on the map. Yeah, that's the, the X that shows us where we are supposed to go, supposedly. But, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I, I'm drawing a complete blank as to where we are supposed to go with this, but we're definitely not going down this side because that will drop us right on the spikes. Uh, let's see, vines. Whip me, please. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're welcome, Noon. You're so welcome. Climb atop the ball, what? Uh, recess, treasure, floor. Okay, I think this is, I think we are where the it is. Let's see another text from the K, fairly easy jump. From the ends of the bridge, okay. Oh what, what is what is machete also good for? Besides cutting vines and shit. Billy fish? Nope. Well, that as well, but not in this case. Because the marker has been on brand the entire time here. Oh! But there's still a clue on it. Yeah. Uh, um, that didn't look right. Okay, another run through. <laughs> I, I, say, I, I saw... So the rube looked like it was about to get caught. It looked like a, yeah, you know, when the rube started to tear. But I didn't figure you were supposed to cut it. Hmm. I, I just thought you meant that, oh, it's soon gonna break. No, it meant you were supposed to cut it with the machete. Yeah. Okay, yeah, th that's a clue I overlooked and in, in accidentally ignored. Yeah, I, I, I thought it was just uh, damage, it damaged the bridge, not that we were supposed to cut it down. Uh, that yeah, is a bit of a double-sided thing. It is very nice and a bit clever, but it was also very easy to miss. Yeah, or rather, you, you, will, you may see it, but you may not think much about it. You'll think, oh, this bridge might break. Yeah, that's the point. Except... Yeah, you're supposed to break it with the machete, not with your weight. Hmm. Oh, Didn't dear we have something God. earlier where we had to use the machete on something as well? Something other than vines and such? Uh, what the heck is Noon doing? <laughs> I can't tell. I think one of those uh, gifts was just some uh, flailing arms or something. Yeah, I guess that ice cube. Let's carefully get through. <clears throat> okay. Actually, no, I don't. I don't remember if we used if we climbed up. Uh, uh, I don't remember if we climbed up a uh, fallen bridge earlier or not, or something. So I can't really tell if this was uh, just a bit of mean design or a smart design. Oh, sure. Probably a mix of both. Uh, okay, I was going to light that. This stream's trap. Also... So we don't have to go through the entire circuit again. Yeah, it was just the save. Don't forget to save. What's this? Look what I found. I think it's a key. Yeah. Jay's getting buffeted with rocks. Ooh. Okay, we were not supposed to run out from one bowler. The entire room is collapsing. Yeah, I, I was thinking we were just going to have to run from a <laughs> from a rock. And welcome back, Noon. Oh, welcome back, Noon. Okay, that stung a bit more than was necessary, but oh well. We've got enough uh, 
quote unquote herbs of our own. Lordy, you have to agree with me. These, these looks like damn teeth, don't they? Yeah, if you turn it sideways, yeah. It's mostly that one uh, big one on the left side that gives the start of the impression, I think. It stands out more than the others. Yeah, they, all of them look teeth-like. So, you do have to agree with me that once you notice that, it kind of makes you worry that it may try to eat you. Okay. Monkey key, okay. What are we going to find here? What do you know? Me. It worked. Hello. This all looks in pretty good condition. Very good condition, actually. Yeah, looks very nice. Hmm. There's buttons. What do these do? Hello. Hello. Okay. And this it one. Won't budge. <laughs> won't budge. Let's see. Can I climb you? No, just an inch or two too high. Wrong button again. It won't budge. These need to be pressed in a certain order. Uh, yeah, we can't go anywhere else, so... It won't budge. Hmm. Okay, these need to be pressed in a certain order, I'm guessing. Retract this, then. Now, what do the others of you do? Okay. Now, the other ones are not going to move any... It won't budge. No. Hmm. Okay. Let's just check what each of them do. This one brings out a totem. That one brings out a wall surrounding the totem. This one... It won't budge. Okay. And the other one is also stuck then? It won't budge. Hmm. Okay, so we have two buttons that bring up two different things. Wait, maybe the others only work once these are up? Uh, we tried these when the the other one was up. It won't budge. And the other one also doesn't work, I'm guessing. Oh, now it does. See? And it turned it around. <clears throat> Hmm. Uh, okay. <laughs> Does this do anything now? It won't budge. No. Guess that that will do something with the other thing? Okay. Wait, is there anything up there? Oh, okay, there is something up there, it looks like. Can we get that from here? Nope. Oh, wait, I think I get it. This is a retrieval puzzle. I think. There's like a green tiki key up there. Oh. Now we spin it. Reset everything. Okay. But yeah, what we need to do is to bring up, uh, bring it up entirely, then use that one button to spin it so that the key will get spun out of its holder, and then bring it all down. There we go. Now this one was the one that made it spin, I think. Yes. And... 
that seems to respond the key. And there we go. Okay, so it's just a simple case of <laughs> pressing them in the correct <clears throat> correct order. What have we here? Another tiki statue. Also with stubby little arms. Whoa! Okay. What the heck? <laughs> it just sank in further because there was no other exit. Okay, Rocky. Boom. Hello. Mexic Maracas. That is really? going to come loose, I'm thinking. What we're having is a very ancient giant meat wrong here. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Oh, more meatballs. Let's do a save. 7.12 by now. Yep, 12. Okay. As you see, see people, these meatballs are very rich in minerals. <laughs> Too rich in minerals for consumption. <laughs> yep. oh, sorry, wasn't it to see that uh, hill? Oh, love. <laughs> Just kick after. Oh, come on! And that basically added insult to the injury. Yeah, or injury upon death. Yeah, a bit of an overkill. Like, really? Okay, Jones jump this time. There we go. Like, this is Indiana Jones, not Wesker from uh, Resident Evil. Okay, we can't reach that, so that means we need to go back, I think. Yep. Death by hot sauce. Yeah, hot sauce and spicy meatballs. Let's see. Oh, that, 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 that does sound tasty. Oh wait, I can't eat that today. I prepared some spicy noodles and added some uh, chicken meatballs to it. Okay. So does that count as spicy meatballs? <laughs> I guess, yeah. Oh, almost fell again. I guess it counts in a more shitty way. Hold on. Uh, I thought so. If it's too high to jump, it's not high enough. It's not too high to climb. I didn't actually even see the connection point there. No. Oh. Yeah, I was to say this is a whip, not grappling hook. Come on down. Oh, wait, there's something there. There on the floor. Yeah, it's a gold now bar what? this time. Hmm. Let's see, no surprise rock monsters or anything. Nope. Well, it's not a surprise, but it's still one. I'm too used to space bar being jump. So I keep pressing it to try and jump away from things. <laughs> but it's alt here. Medicinal herbs. Okay. I think this is the only game I hear uh, the jump but being alt and not space. Let's see, there's another rock monster over there. Like, I've seen games where space bar is the inventory button? But only in games where there is no jump. There we go. Uh, can we even? Yes, we can. Just get a, like an inch or two of walking space. Okay. 
okay, I didn't actually expect that to work, so we can't just this? hit and run them <laughs> with the Maraca. Luckily enough. <laughs> okay. I'm pretty sure this is going to be the end of the level, or leading to the sanctuary. One of these needs to go in here. It fits. And then the other one. So we'll see whatever the hell is sealed away here. Yeah, I don't think this is what people have in mind when they say there. sliding doors. Okay, we're not getting them back this time. Okay, that shot real fast. Of course it did. Of course it bloody did. Okay. What have we here? Silva. Hmm. Thanks. On appearance sake alone, I actually prefer silver over gold. I'm not actually... Same. Oh, uh... A lot of the personality. What's this guy's body temperature? Myself, when I run a fever, I get cranky. Uh... <laughs> I think this is a bit less of a time for jokes, Dr. Jones. Yeah. I almost forgot. I have tried to look up lore, and there has been comics. But there also was a series. Yeah, young uh, Indiana Jones. Yeah, I, I've just seen one episode. I don't remember uh, if that was liked or not. Ooh. Well, uh, for my bad, only one, one episode had some simple not lore. That was Dracula. Okay. And it was apparently also criticized for being very ham fisted with historical figures. Not and historical really lessons. His... Oh, ooh, the... Ow. Okay, I thought it was. <laughs> I didn't think it was going to attack outright like this. Or I probably should have expected it, but. That... Oh, yeah. Uh, with shows of the what 80s and find? 90s. Yeah. You... Now, historical accuracy is uh, not to be found there. Oh, the, 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 that was the, the issue. Oh, well, semi sorry. He, Lucas said it was. Uh, for him to get it made, he said it would be. have some historical education with it as well. Hence, it was very. they was very emphasized with the historical parts. Especially with the youngest version of Indie Day event. Or just ham facing with the history. Is this what I think it is? Let's see. Frame your mind well, wherefore eyes avail not. The unseen is unstoppable. Here I was. Spitting out little embers. Uh, you almost in. Okay, careful now. But yeah, the, the YouTubers who spoke of this seem to have liked it. But apparently, the DVDs they released, they made some cuts into. And instead of episodes, they were made into several long uh, movies. They were okay. clipped together. Okay, apparently again. did not make the rule thing flow well. So you recommend to just watch the episodes on YouTube. Yeah. Okay. But from what he described, I just felt like, okay, he may have liked it. But I, it sounds like something I would actually dislike. But it sounded like they, they like, sure, you get to know how Indy developed. But also the contradictions to what the movies did. 
Okay. About his past, and they were part of new supernatural things and extremely little what Indy did. did, did. So, yeah, I think I would have disliked it. Yeah, you can see the front rocky. Okay. Now, I remember what this thing does from memory. Oh, hello. I was actually expecting it to find a little bit of a safe place there, but apparently not. Uh, actually, actually, whilst the uh, hot hat over, is over there, let's Look go grab this. A medical kit. Okay. Do that. No, that did not kill it. There we go. Got a leg full of stone shards as well. Oh, is this what I think it is? Let's see. Frame your mind well. Wherefore eyes avail not. The unseen is unstoppable. Here Does this thing remind you of anything? Uh, about something, yeah. And also, I think I realized what this monster sort of is. What then? I think it's, I think it's related to the other monsters we met here. <laughs> oh, not that. But, uh, but tell me, what's the difference between lava and magma? Temperature. Oop. Okay, big boy. Uh, let me go. Then you see what I mean, what this one has in relation with the others, then. Yeah. No, this one has sort of crab claws and the hell? Okay, just... <laughs> stone face. Okay. Uh, we're going to need to use this new toy of ours somewhere. Uh, let's see. First, let's actually equip it. Let's see. Attack let's part. I don't think we can actually use the same. Okay, I'd forgotten that. <laughs> okay, I, I thought this was something else. No, no. <laughs> it turns us bloody invisible. Yeah, okay. look at its eye. Do you see what I mean? Yeah. Uh, let's see, what is the shortcut for that one? Not that. U I N O O P N B V Z X. Okay, X is also jump, it seems. F. Yep. No. Oh, G is grenade. <laughs> yep. And that was. H is apparently quick heal. Not that it was I'm needed. I'm not sure that's a good idea. Hmm. Okay, what is the quick button for Tacklet's part then? Oop. Spikes. Let's see. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> no need to kill the uh, monster defending the thing. If you just can sneak away from it. Wasn't there a Komodo dragon here just a second ago? Ah, oh, well. Nope. And, uh, guess we're killing it after all. <laughs> okay, just to drain the entire lake. Well, I think you're supposed to do that to reach something. Yeah, because there's another entryway over that way. And this is actually back over here. We never actually went this way. Probably because I'm pretty sure we can't actually make the, the jump from there to here. But nice to see how it loops around again. Yeah. Because we saw this face from up behind us now. Okay. Upsy-daisy. 
And let's see, is there any... Oh! Okay! <laughs> no. Dylan, we can't just go for fisticuffs. <laughs> Don't! Fisticuffs the magma mo... Uh, which was with the lava with the magma? Uh, lava is uh, outside the... Uh, outside the earth, uh, magma is inside. So basically underground, out, yeah, overground. Okay. Can't see anything to say? Nope. Now those were some rock hard abs. Oh, come on. <laughs> come on. Seriously. <laughs> oh, no, that, oh yeah. S U I Q. Nope. Been we have enough for again. the map. I don't know if this immediately starts it or anything, or if it just starts it at the end of the game. So, shall we buy it now or leave it for the next one? Or the next level? Uh, I said we leave it for next time and do research on it beforehand. Okay. Uh, then just not buying anything at the moment. Oop. Uh, yeah. Sophia! Turner! Where is everybody? Uh, yeah, I remember this level. And I had a feeling it would be over here. Hmm. Let's see then. Oop. Hey! Let's just nab that. What's this? Pick up this. A medical kit. And anything in here? No, just clothes and a bra. So we know that Sophia is likely around somewhere. And the Russians are as well. No, not that one. Does the machete work against them? Uh, yeah, you can't just use it as a weapon as well. We've been filleting fish with it after all. <laughs> work on the Russians as well. Could be a good way to say ammo. Yeah, we have a lot of ammo, so no need for at the moment, at least. Let's Sorry. see. Okay. There we go. Just one to get rid of him before we tried anything else. Now, I think you can take a guess as to what we need to do with uh, the name of the level. Uh -huh. Yeah, and so I know there's something weird here. Uh, yeah, it's a bit of a blocky car. Yeah, how how do you drive it? A jeep. Let's see if this thing still runs. Like glitching through. He's like through it. They did a bit poor work with this jeep. Yeah. But then again, this is the Nintendo 64 era of gaming. <laughs> yeah, but even they made cars like Jeeps better than this. Okay, this thing has some momentum. So, yeah. Tire tracks up this way. Alright. Now, if I remember correctly, we're going to need to go back and forth or at least side to side with this thing every now and then in this level. Ooh, oh. Okay. Give me that. Hmm. Gold. Uh, yeah, we wouldn't be able to get up that hill on foot, so that is what the car is for. Yeah. Oh, we did with that. Like, I agree with Helium that I like Cyril a bit more like... If you give me a full suit of armor, I will not want it fully gilded in gold. I will probably have it more silvery. I like gold and more as an accent. Yeah, like if a that makes small sense. decoration. Would also be a lot cheaper, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. So, armor made of gold would be not advised. You could, pay, again, gild the armor by painting a small layer of gold on it to make it rust proof but also 
paint you as a very big target. Let's see. The Russians blew up the bridge, so we need to get across somehow. Dear. My first yeah. thought was to just get across, but no. Oh, the heck. But yeah. A full suit of ghoul and armor, I always thought felt just a bit Body. much. Uh, what, what? Gaudy. Yeah, that's probably the good gaudy. So I, I, I prefer silver. Then again, I also I do also like moon uh, more than the sun. Okay. And moon and silver have a history, if I could guess, say so. I think so, yeah. Okay, is this enough speed? Nope. Okay. Hmm. Okay, we oh, clearly dear. need to jump over. Is, is there a turbo or something that I'm overlooking? Uh, actually, I think... I mean, is it both gold and zero are awesome colors for accident, actually, when I think about it. Okay, shift into a higher gear so that is how we're probably supposed to jump it yep <laughs> not like that though uh, <coughs> what the heck Killian? a small fact the, the word lunatic actually comes from well luna different uh, word for moon there we go that is true that I actually recall. We learned that some years ago. Definitely before the pandemic. Someone quickly hiding around the corner. <clears throat> yeah, don't, I don't know what exactly caused Story. that word to be, a, be a spawned, so to say. Uh, but I'm presuming that, uh, yeah, back in the time of uh, <clears throat> sun worshipping and such, that, uh, yeah, moon worshippers were considered, well, insane and thus lunatic. No, I think it was something else. Mm -hmm. Or, actually, I, I say, I think there was a belief that the that exposure to the moon would cause insanity or something. Ooh. Or or something. I might have to look this up. It has been a while ago. I feel like I think I think it may partially be related to, to werewolves. Could be. Or rather, like like you had someone so crazy that they howl at the moon or something else that they or you have a person who just goes what nuts. During the night. A nutty night. Oh dear. But yeah, th 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 that's the place we had to look up. But... <laughs> beep beep, motherfucker. Cold <laughs> uh, Russian uniform, meet American Jeep. Oh dear. Okay, random freeze and crash. Okay. <laughs> I think that's the second time that the game has seem has crashed for seemingly no reason. Yeah, we did luckily put a save closer than that. Or than yeah. the last one. Why can't see you gee this time? Yeah, there you go. Screen cap I didn't turn the screen capture off. And there's not anything there that uh, is of too much consequence, really. Okay. Yeah, that does mean that we get to run over a Russian soldier again. And grab gold again. Hmm. Well, that's what I heard, bloody neighbor. Yeah, I like that they even have an animation for them getting hit and flying. Should we... 
against those as well. Yeah, they're hiding behind a box, and they would probably just uh, completely block us from moving. So... Oh. Okay, dodge roll. <laughs> Didn't know they would do that. Oh, the dumbass has crashed our car here. Truck. Thank you. Look what I found. Hmm. I wouldn't mind just owning a box of imitation gold coins sometime, uh, someday. Now what? Uh, yeah. That, well, it, well. <laughs> look at this. You shove that in your pocket, Jones. I will say this. A chest of gold coins does look more pleasant than a chest of silver coins. Yeah. That's the move that I will go over uh, towards uh, gold. But when it comes to something like a um, clothing, armor, and weapons, then silver easily. Yeah, I, I think you can buy like uh, prop jewelry and such, and that would probably be the easiest way to get like a full bo little box of stuff. Uh, you? Uh, actually, no, this would be a bad idea for you to buy chocolate gold. No, prop, not chocolate. Oh, I know, there's a prop. I just thought that you could always try chocolate gold. Though, I don't know if that's more expensive or cheaper. It would eventually go bad. No. Oh, hello there. D depends. Get off the road. Will it go back first, or will you eat it first? <laughs> Probably the latter. Uh, is that all? Yep. Okay. I think we have a bit of freedom in this area, because I think we could... Uh, we could get over a hill a little bit back. But first, let's it explore over this way. Wait, you gonna drive over yourself? No. <laughs> Let's see. Been a bit since we've needed to crawl through someplace. Oh no. Oh, another song stuck in my head. No. Far mm. over the hills and far away. An idol. Night witch. Okay. Night wish. <laughs> Not white night witch. <laughs> that, that, that's something else. Okay. Hmm. I get, I get the feeling that, that just loops uh, the other way goes up there as well, so let's take a look. There'll be no fruit loops in this loop, folks. Sorry. There we go. I'll probably make that fuck somewhere cry for there'll be no fruit loops. Let's be a bit careful here. Actually, I don't know even if Noom likes Fruit Loops. Nope, okay. okay. Definitely putting a save for this. I don't know. I, I haven't eaten Fruit Loops. I, I'm pretty sure I haven't ever eaten any sort of cereal or cereal-like things. And good thing I saved. I haven't eaten cereals. Just... Like Cocoa Puffs, Rice Puffs, Corn Flakes, Frosties. There's some pillows-like ones, but small ones without sugar. But Fruit Loops? I don't even think they're so. I don't think they've ever been sold here. Very obvious back wall. Hmm. I need to check the local supers to see if they have a, any of those. Um, hey. I'm pretty sure they don't. An idol. Yeah, like, they, they have some fr uh, fruit bits and such now, but they're not fruit loops. They are more of a. Uh, what are they called? Fusli or something? Like, Fus meant muscly? to be a help. Uh, sorry, one? Yeah, muscly or something like that? Yeah. M muscly, yeah. We just call it muesli here, I think. Ooh, they, they are supposed to be. Healthy snack, and that man doesn't look healthy anymore. No. 
Then again, he was going to throw a grenade at us. In the... Yeah, yeah. There we go. Take it, but grenade. don't eat it. It may look like a miniature pineapple, but it's not. Oh yeah, they do kind of look like a pineapple. Even though they were named after another fruit. There. Grenade apple. Actually, yeah, pomegranate. Uh, it's weird to be actually calling grenade apples. Granate apple. So, uh, oh. yeah. Wait. Is that what you Dutch people call it? Uh, granat apple. Pomegranate. I think that... that uh, that sounds so similar to how we say it in Sweden. Granat apple. Yeah, the, the, the same word, basically. Oh. Uh, almost. We... We use a special letter for apple. Uh, it looks like an A with two dots over it. Okay. Ah. That's how you pronounce it. Apple. Okay. Sounds like they're driving around with the gunner in the back, and well, we don't have a we. Can we actually pull a <laughs> a weapon whilst we're driving? Just want to just grab a leather. Okay, we can't pull a weapon. Uh, Do you sad? Yeah, I'd rather that Jones pay full attention to driving. <laughs> yeah, probably safer, especially considering. Um, uh, <clears throat> how surfing free people drives in borderland. Uh, let's see, we're just here. I'm actually reminded now of an old arcade game that I played at some point or another. Uh, it was one of those light gun you know, games. Uh, where you, you were all... It was... You could play it in two player. Uh, hello, if you've been here. Uh, but yeah, the first... If you played it solo, you had to drive and shoot at the same time. Was there anything to the left there? It's not safe to get out here. Uh, and the second player could... If you had the second player, they could just focus fully on the shooting. But yeah, you had to also drive a car uh, to the left and right. It wasn't too complicated, of course. Uh, I don't remember if I ever actually played it myself, but it did look a lot of fun. Yeah, that, that many old arcade games look fun, especially the big ones that actually introduce it 3D, like... Like the Light Gun Jurassic Park game. That... I think it was Konami or Capcom made. And I, I Capcom seen... I actually saw it, saw this machine. A lot of it existed in a, in a, what, what would it be in sweet in English, uh, Gothenburg uh, Park. Okay. Not, not park. Oh, I forgot what. Oh, what? what festival? Okay, license plate, please. For your car insurance. I forgot if it's, if it's Tivoli or what. An amusement park. Okay. We have a lot of at least fames in Sweden park, which I have been to when I was younger. They have a Rusty Park one, where you drove cars, shot dinosaurs, and whatnot. I didn't play it, but I watched my schoolmates play it and get wrecked. Like that guy? Okay, that. Uh, give it enough time, and uh, these two might be confused for lovers and death. Oh, ew! Just because we share that? something, that Resident game is almost sort of tiny bit infamous for. No. Yeah. Uh, um. Apparently, you can drive over under a uh, solar port, a bias. My mate, my mate is Saurus, I think it was called. Was. And boy. if you're not careful, now what? It may kill you by um, taking a dump on you. Yes. 
and to avoid that happening, you apparently have to shoot it in the rear. There we go. Okay. I, I feel mm. like the the entire fragment of that was probably spawned by people joking that uh, that the, the biker guy in the second movie was driving under one of them before he was joked. Marshall really tried to shit on him when he tried to drive under it. And decided to put in a game. Okay, I think if we get over this hill here, that's the end of the level or towards the end of it. So let's take a little peek back. Yep. See if there's Careful other now. stuff to find. Let's see. Okay, yeah, that is the exit. And it seems we have. Okay, I. Yeah, I believe the map gets revealed as we get close to it. So we have been to basically everywhere here. There's a little thing on the side here, it seems. Let's see. Is that something to climb to, or is that just. Hmm. I don't see a crawl space, so let's just move on. No need to really hang around here for too long. Yeah, and... Hmm. Okay. Babylonians really traveled far. Yeah. So this means they found America before Vikings and Columbus. Okay. Um, yeah, let, let's still leave it for next time. Uh, there should be plenty more chances for us to get it because we are nowhere near the end of the game. Or we're getting towards it. But Pacific Ocean. And uh-oh. Teotihuacan, Pyramid of the Sun, except it's not too sunny in here. Okay. I'd forgotten about this place. I do recognize the general features of it, but I thought uh, we were going somewhere else before we would... Yeah, I, I, <laughs> I recognize the place, but I didn't remember it. I do remember now what we'll be facing at the end of this. And um, yeah, I'm not going to say any more about that. Let's see. Oh, I have an idea what it might be. What's this? A medical kit. Uh, let's have a look. Is this a little lighting paste? Yep, it Basically, is. Basically, I have a guess it's something indie gonna hate. Let's see, is that a keyhole or a button? Button, okay, I thought it was a keyhole. Yeah, and again, the keyhole. Oh, seer and death symbols. Hmm. If Ron were still around, he probably could tell us a thing or two about this. Ooh. Maybe do he. He, he's, he did say he's worried about history and. He, Mexico and Inca are not the same. For True. In Mexico, it was Aztecs. Yeah, but he'd probably still have more insight on it than us. Okay. Were we supposed to see someone walking by here or something? What have we here? I think it's a key. Is this sandstone? Key? Okay, clever there. Uh, could be. It also looks pretty much like brick. 
Yeah, okay. I don't know if Aztecs used sandstones a lot. I do know Incas did not use sandstones. Okay. Corpia just uh -huh. comes, into his, yeah, comes into existence right in front of us. Okay. Well, uh, yeah, so we should have expected that there'd be traps. Let's see. Hmm. Oop. No. What have we in there? Oop. Be more concerned about what's in here with us. Hmm. What's okay, with the music? A sign that something is up. Um, level 9 we are in. Okay. Can we push or pull you? We can't interact with you. That's so okay. Okay. <laughs> uh. Okay, the traps here seem to be the, of the kind to trap you in with something. Though it seems that in this case, the thing it, we were supposed to be trapped in was dead. But no, it's, instead we got a sideways... <laughs> we got a spider crab. <laughs> Why was that thing scuttling sideways? Why the, hey. Oh, that's what you call a spider crab. I got a bit worried if we do a more. I thought, wait, you can't see a difference between a spider crab and a spider? Uh, I, I guess it must be some sort of glitch or something that has it walking sideways. But they can oh, walk sideways. Stones carved like gears. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. If my my thought process got interrupted a bit earlier, <clears throat> that's stuck. But, uh, yeah. Uh, I think Vaughn would probably work. still have just a bit more insight into things than we would. Mm, what have we here? Okay, elevator. I can always ask him uh, when he's more awake. Let's see. Oop, thank mm. you. Hmm. No. Let's just head down and see what we can do with these gears. <clears throat> okay, we have doors, sort of. Can we... Yeah, we can just move these. I'm guessing we'll have to open these up by putting these in front. What? Head, a head, a head, and another head. Let's see, we've got a bird, fish, uh, all three of them, and the uh, dog or cat like one i don't think i want to use the term cat for that one but this one i don't know is that supposed to be a bird or a turtle now the left side looks like a beak to me beak just texture and crack. let's see there's webbing down here Okay, that's a big, uh, that's a big drop. I'm guessing the mechanism isn't going to work just yet until we put something in the middle there. Why am I getting Minecraft Desert Temple vibe? It's some kind of switch. It's a snake icon. That won't work. Okay, we're going to have to drop down. <clears throat> Uh, 
Okay. Where is that? There it is. Okay. So just drop down, kill whatever tries to get us. I wanted to climb up in the middle bit, but I, I, once again I got the wrong button. Uh, what have we here? It was a statue. With this very flat snake head. I hope you, you land on something that was about to get angry. <laughs> what is with this block here? We need to put something there as a sort of offering. We can't seem to move it. Let's see. Actually, the base of this thing. Yeah, we need to move this thing up. Uh, do we have anything? We have the water key. Wait, can we move these? I see what looks like handles. No, oh, and scuff marks. So yeah, we just move these into position, I'm guessing. And then... Oh. Then that goes up. Okay. Yeah, I think the stone gave you a clue which one it was. Do we need, do we need to pull all of these out? And of course, do they have anything hidden behind them? Okay, we need to pull all of them out. Hmm. Okay. Last one. We just need to get up ourselves. Yeah. And, well, oh. we see where. Or how. Hopefully, it could be a trap. The traps are very painful. Usually. Okay, up this thing. And I'm guessing the door opened over that way because I see an in bit. Yep. Bit of the walkway missing. Okay, no. It's the decoration. Oh, that way. All right. Hmm. I, I kind of hope they remake uh, or will make it in the Unknown series at some point. The... Uh, yeah. Uh, if the things we've heard about the upcoming movie are anything to go by, it might be more that this, <laughs> the franchise gets even more killed than it already is. Uh, the, the, the actor is very too old for this now. Yeah. What have Again, we here? I'm okay with the concept of uh, one of his children take over, as long as it's done respectfully. Yeah. And from what I heard from one of the test screening, it was not done respectfully. Which was the apparently the main thing that really tripped people into rage. At least for the test group uh, who watched it, and they were so pissed by it. Yeah. Best we can hope with that is that they basically wrote rewrote the entire thing with that. Yeah, yeah. I see in trailer. I it's not bad, but it's not good either. After two thousand years, the machine still works. An old Azram didn't even have a college degree. Um. Okay, that didn't seem to do anything. So. We do this, and it starts to spin. Or it turns. Hmm. Do we need to bring it to 
the walls or yeah I'm... oh wait I think I oh I see does this under bit spin with it if so then we just need to put the discs in position And then we can start opening up the doors. So uh, now we spin it once. I used to realize something. Uh... Okay, I don't know. Do you want to announce what you learned today? Uh, what specifically, or do you mean with the work? Uh, with the work. Uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, my, my contract is not getting extended for what I personally think are rather petty reasons. Uh, but yeah, it'll probably be for the best since, well, <laughs> it had been playing havoc, uh, havoc on my uh, health and such. Not extremely so, but enough to really freaking annoy me at the very least. Uh, I don't think we can move this one now. Yeah, I actually told my mother, and when I told her... That you sleep schedule pattern is changed at times three different times at times. Then she told yeah. is that for what I to agree with me that yeah that's not healthy. That will break anyone. Like there was another thing or another pattern that we could pick. Uh, a part of it was also because I was a in a flex schedule, meaning that they could put me in a lot more thing in a lot more randomly uh, pl random places so. or as shifts uh, but yeah the other pattern was basically one almost a full week of work and then a week of uh, <clears throat> a week off but uh, I'm pretty sure I would not have liked that either yeah Next. Like, I understand you get annoyed that you, it doesn't extend it by for petty reasons. Says that. Like, yeah, again, I'm happy it doesn't get extended, but. But the just people, they do it due to petty reasons, you see it? Sounds like they adding insult to it. Uh, th the main reason was because I wasn't able to get a certification that was quote unquote necessary, even though it would never, if, if ever, get used uh, in the position that I hold. It's more uh, outside patrol thing. Uh, just stuff to how to interact with people like this and that or such. Uh, but yeah. I just cannot interact with people in a way that would be required for that. Uh, okay. Well. With that said, it, it will mean that we... Hopefully be able to have a normal sketch... Ske Stream schedule again. Yeah. Like... I'm still up for double streams. I'm still up for that. However, we can easily plan out rest days and all that. Yeah. Uh, let's see. This puzzle is a little bit annoying in just the amount of work we need to do for this. But yeah, since they turn opposite to each other, these two should now meet either here or at the other side. So let's see which it is. <clears throat> and I'm guessing we need to open up all four of them eventually. So here we go. Yeah, okay, I got that one right. Now it goes spin. Uh, but yeah, I'll have to go look for new work, of course, and yeah, between works, we should be able to have a, ske a steady schedule, and after that, we'll have to see what uh, the new work will allow. Yeah, like, I can see this. Between 
no work and work. I can see us doing double streams just as usual. But uh, double streams will be a question mark later on. Yeah. I also wouldn't be fully against, like, trying to do long streams more often. Like with uh, the last one we did with Prince of Persia, it went very well, actually. <laughs> Time didn't... Yeah. Do I think that one went well due to we started early. Probably, yeah. Uh, I keep going for eight. Eight, nine, Since three. First time we did long stream for an anniversary. We sort of did that without dying. We just almost fell asleep. Yeah. Because bloody how long did I forgot? Did we stream into eleven or twelve? Uh, late at the very least, yeah. Yeah. Hence the idea of if you do a long stream, we start earlier or in the afternoon. Yeah. Um, so we hmm. play the game. How to say this? With a, with a fresh mind as possible. Yeah, without uh, <laughs> almost dying. It's... Yeah. Dying of sleep. I'm guessing this is how we get back or something. Yeah, what the? Oh, it was just the. Oh, damn it. For first, one of the walls were blood covered. Yep, damn it. Okay, did not see that little shit coming at all. Okay, we've got a, a few ant poison kids left. Let's see. That's just back down there. So... What else is there around here? Okay, simple enough. Rather obvious at that. Yeah, don't give me the stink guy there. <laughs> now what? <laughs> and that seems to be it here. So there was I, I just mean, a treasure room. Obviously, I gotta like that trap that he actually looks like a snake. Yeah, so if someone was that in front of you, it would probably look first like a, a snake ate him. Yeah. Or just... Uh... No. He I will look okay. Maybe not headbutt, but... Killer boo? <laughs> what, what, what would you call it? Uh... A death hug? At high velocity and high impact. With your face? <laughs> this is not Cthulhu. Well, that, that is how rhinos work. <laughs> or do their thing, at least. Rhinos don't hug people with their horns or face. Yeah, but they do go full out at them. Yeah, it's called horn impalement. <laughs> Okay, since we're done with this one, let's pull it on here. Okay. Uh, put this one out here. I think uh, I see a the pattern that we can use mostly. If we had one over there now, it would have worked a lot. Actually, let's pull this one in. What we need to do to get uh, these things lined up is to basically have two of the gears oppos on opposite ends of the statue in the middle, with one being close and the other being far, and then they will line up to the sides of where they were opposite. Those two, or these two, were on this angle apart, so they are together on the sides. So... I need to... First off, I, I need to get a block in there. And either of these will do for that. <clears throat> yeah, but I also want to try and well, open up the other... On the other axis. So, give that a spin. Okay. 
Okay. Uh, another. And let's see. Push this one out. Then this one can be opened up. So I get the feeling this one is supposed to be the last or something. But that, that's probably the actual path forward. Um, let's leave that one there at the moment. And we pull it out when it's on the opposite side. This, this is going to be a bit of a leg puzzle, uh, a legwork puzzle. Oh dear. Once more. And there we go. Now thingy goes spinny. one out. Okay, that is a clever design. No. Yeah, you, the cogs on these wheels attach to the ridges under the doors and force them open. Yep. Okay. Now, we need... We need one on the other side here. And we need one on the, the door that is now closest to us. That isn't open yet. And once we have one in there, and we make sure that we have... Uh, <clears throat> we have two gears across from each other along that axle now, then we should be able to open up the remaining doors. Um, push you in for the moment. And we pull you in. Okay, spin it once more. Actually, Dawn. put this one back in there. Then we spin it again. Then the <clears throat> and then the other gear should be across from this one. Then we pull this one in, and we should be able to open these two. Yeah, and I started to notice. I'm not sure if it's just ambient sounds, but it sounds like you're not alone in here. There's probably it's... plenty of spiders at the very least. Oh, I think it's something that's not human at least, and definitely not a spider. Yeah, we'll have to see, because I'm not going to give spoilers. <clears throat> Though people can probably make some educated guesses as to what might be lurking around here. There we go. And they line up. And that. It is nice to have some... Uh, I wouldn't really... I'm not sure what to call this. A bigger puzzle or a longer puzzle? It takes a bit more thinking. And it isn't just break this thing to get access to that thing. I guess uh, complex and not complicated puzzle. Probably, yeah. And that's the stream timer actually going off now that we've opened up <laughs> all doors. Oh yeah, 
Yeah, it, it is that time. Sorry, folks. Okay. 9.4. And with that, yeah, exit game. But before we go end the stream, of course, we are going to look for someone to raid. So let me turn that off. We go over here and I turn all this stuff that I've hidden back on. Okay. Open up the browser and let's go look for someone to raid. I'll, I'll probably tinker a bit more with the chat box to have it a bit more on the side or a bit closer to the border of the wind in the gameplay window. <clears throat> Well, yeah, beyond that, I think it is good as is. It, it might I might need to heighten it or something in case uh, we get long posts or something because that's going to get uh, squeezed a lot. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, it's not like we have constant chatter going on anyways. So for the moment, change the screen share to the browser and let's have a look at who is online. And there's quite a few people online, actually. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, we have WBPL76, who probably is just starting up, because they have zero viewers at the moment. They're streaming Contraband Police. Uh, we have Cider Delish, streaming Digimon World's Next Order. Reef the Leaf is streaming Monster Rancher 1DX again. Uh, Nico Silverado is doing art. I'm Nice is streaming Super Mario Land 2, 6 Golden Coins. Okay. Live Grow is streaming Against the Storm. Kaskozuk is streaming Monster Sanctuary. I'm a Flanker is playing Mordhau. Been a while since I've seen that. The Digital Hazard yeah. is streaming Digimon World 2. Big V Streams is streaming Morrowind. Uh, is, yeah, is streaming Morrowind. Elder Scrolls 3. Let me double check. The place is muted. Are they? They're a bit of a multiplayer group. So are they doing multiplayer or something? Uh, let's see. Open and double. You can play multiplayer on this one. Uh, well, but you can through mods, I'm pretty sure. How many have rebuilt season? Yeah, they're playing yeah, with mods. They, they, I know they've done that with Skyrim, but M Morrowind? That one might be too old for that. Hmm. Maybe. And last but not least at the moment, under 100 viewers, is Rococo Pufay playing Jump King. The heck is Jump King? Oh, it's this game. Uh, Code Bullet made a video about training an AI to play this, <laughs> which had him tearing out his hair, of course. Okay. Any of these sounds interesting to raid, or shall we go look at recommended? Uh, let's take a look at recommended, okay. just in case. Oh, uh, let's go to the main not page. Not a big list. Also, why is the. It seems that for some reason the browser has defaulted to Dutch for some reason. Anyways, we have Jackal Paw Pat streaming The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword HD. That is on our to-do list eventually. We have Wolf Machina streaming Railroads Online. Okay. Extra Credits is online streaming uh, <laughs> Guild Wars 2. We have Fras uh, Wahar streaming Fall Guys. Uh, 100 or plus, but oh well. And we have Azra Fox streaming Stardew Valley. And last here we have Frog Case streaming Batman Arkham Asylum. Hmm. Hmm. I'm, let's take a peek at some of these. Uh, okay, they're on the BRB at the moment. Uh, how are they doing here? Okay, they're playing as a Savari Ranger. I should play. I should start up with Guild Wars Two again. I have been missing out on the entirety of the pre, the uh, of the of the last expansion. The last expansion and I, is good. And I need uh, to catch up with Living Worlds before that. Uh, let's see. Hmm. Do we do we go for the frog or do we go for the extra credits? Oh. Gears grinding. <laughs> Ancient Aztec gears grinding. Uh, the frog, then? Uh, yeah, let's, yeah, let's go for with the frog. Okay. They aren't back yet, but oh well. Copy over their name. Uh, go to our place and slash rate paste. But before we go with that, of course, 
Uh, thank you everyone who has been watching now or later. Thank you Noon for chatting along a bit. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, thank you as always, Drakir and Ram, of course. Even though he was You're here welcome in a short us all. bit. <laughs> You're welcome <laughs> as always, my friend. And uh, <clears throat> well, stretch of the stream. <laughs> okay. Uh, we'll see if I'll be able. I probably won't stream in the afternoon tomorrow. I have three days again up to the twenties. Then is when I'm returning to work. I'm. I'll. I'll have double check my schedule, but I'm pretty sure the twentieth I'm at work again. Uh, I still have days to fill in, of course, but I do have a bunch of uh, free days to still fill in or try to schedule in. So I, I think I can probably be free through the entirety or at least majority of April with the time that I have left, <laughs> because I, uh, I just uh, I almost never take in free days. So when I get to the end of a contract, I can get like <laughs> two three months off, almost or most of those at least. I <clears throat> might as well do that after uh, how they, they, they've been treating you. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we'll ho hopefully one stream tomorrow. We'll see if two, because I have to go to the dentist again for more fucking fillings. So yeah, one definitely, two maybe. Yeah, depending on the uh, how quickly the anesthetic works off and such. But for now, thank you all again for watching. Start up the raids, and uh, yeah, until next time, have a nice day, and until then, be safe, everyone, and watch out for magma monsters.